know it. I'll say no other word to you. All right. You'll have your dowry or daughter, fortune or whatever you call it. Well, get it then. between us, Mary-Kate, except those in your own mercenary little heart. I just sleep. D don't be shaming me, please, in front of your friends. What? Oh, okay. Many lessons I took in the art. The Cupid, the blackguard, was ordered. An arrow drove straight to me. Mush, mush, mush to rely on it. Mush, mush, mush to rely So I gathered them with me shillelagh. Oh, he trod on the tail of me. Mush, mush, mush to rely on And just like the dingle poked off, I lathered them with me shillelagh. Oh, he trod on the tail of me coat. Good morning. Good morning. I, uh, I suppose it is a bit early to be calling. Well, after you left last night, Mary-Kate, a couple of us persuaded Danaher to change his mind. It's uh, what might be called a sort of uh, belated wedding present. My things. My furniture. We'd have brought them over last night, Sean, but due to the circumstances, we thought you'd be thanks, needing your sleep. Thanks. Oh, here, you did. Oh, oh, easy, easy now. God bless all here. That's right. Oh, oh, be careful. Over there by the wall. Uh, no, no, no. Now turn it around so that the light shines on the music. That's grand, that's grand. Where, where do you want this? Mighty handy. It, it was my mother's and my, and my mother's mother's before. Where do I put it? What do you suppose? Where do you suppose? We're sorry about the dowry, Mary-Kate. We couldn't make him change his mind about it. Not even Father Lonergan could do it. Now let him keep it. Keep my fortune. Sure, you've got your tables and chairs about you. What do we care about his money? My money. Well, let him have it if it means that much to him. Gangway! What manner of man is it that I have married? A better one, I think, than you know, Mary-Kate.
impetuous. Homeric. so many rock walls in this country. Roses? Are you planting roses? Yeah. Fine farmer you are. Not a turnip or a cabbage or a potato on the plate. Our children. I'm sorry. they will make a very fine display around the cottage. It is a pretty cottage, isn't it? I think so. Well, let's see now. We need a plow and a cultivator and seed for planting and about the horse for the plowing, we could send that black hunter of yours. I'll buy another horse for the plow. Or why not a tractor? Oh, tractor. Nasty, smelly things. And besides, they're an awful price. With a horse, you get other advantages. Yeah. For the roses. <laughs> roses again. You... We could do our shopping in Castletown, and if we put a good foot under us, we could be there and back by supper time. Five miles? Well, that's just a... a good stretch of the legs, I know. All right, get on your walking shoes. I'll be a minute. So you're not a woman to be honked at, huh? Why, it's beautiful. Did you ever see such a... Why, it looks like it could fly. It's only one horsepower, but it's all yours. Mine? Sure. Think you can drive it? Hold on to your hat. <laughs> 